friends, now we are going to Hazrat Halima Saadia Radiyal Anha's house. Halima Saadia was the foster mother of Islamic Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him. Halima and her husband from, were from the tribe of Saad bin Bakr. Bani Saad village is located around 75 kilometers from the city of Taif and is presumed to be the house of Halima Saadia with whom Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him spent his childhood. दिए कि यहां पर तदफीन होती है आजकल भी क्योंकि नई कब्रें खुली हुई नजर आ रही हैं मुझे और उस तरफ आगे एक खेतीबाड़ी की जगह है वहां पे कोई खेतीबाड़ी वगैरह हो रही है और यहां पे इस तरफ भी कुछ ऐसे मैदानी जगह बनी हुई है और आगे भी एक कुआं है वहां पर और इस तरफ से अगर आप देखें तो ये बिल्कुल पहाड़ है सारा खुश्क पहाड़ लेकिन मुझे तो बहुत मोहब्बत आ रही है इस पहाड़ पे मुझे बहुत अच्छा लग रहा है ये पहाड़ यहाँ पे दरख्त है पहाड़ के दरमियान में दरख्त है और इस दरख्त के पास देखते हैं देख ये देखें ये दरख्त है और यहाँ से ऊपर से खड़े होके देखो तो वो वहाँ पर है जहाँ पर शक्कर सदर वाला वाकई हुआ था यानी कि आप सल्लल्लाहु अलैहि वसल्लम का सीना चेक करने वाला वाकई वो जगह है सब और वहाँ पर कहा जाता है कि हजरत हरीम सहदी रबी का क्रैम ऑफ कर यहाँ से दूर से नजर आ रही Hazrat Amina, the mother of Muhammad, peace be upon him, was waiting for the arrival of the Banu Saad. The women within the tribe of the Banu Saad were the foster mothers. They would take care of the children of Makkah to the deserts and teach them classical Arabic and other skills. In return, they would receive a salary from the family of the child in Makkah. While Halima was traveling to Makkah, she was unable to feed her child because her she-camel stopped lactating. In Mecca, all those looking for foster children rejected taking care of the half-orphan. Muhammad peace be upon him because they feared not getting paid since his father was dead. Halima felt sad that every woman in her tribe had received a child except her. So she told her husband Al-Arif, by God, I do not like the idea of returning with my friends without a child. I will go and take that orphan. Her husband agreed. Immediately after accepting him, blessings came to her and her family. Her husband's flock during the time of a great famine was healthy and producing milk, while the rest of the people's flocks were dying. When Prophet peace be upon him was two years old, Halima took him to Amina and insisted that she let him remain with her to which she related. A strange and mysterious event happened a few months later. Muhammad peace be upon him foster brother was playing alone as the Prophet was not like other kids and did not play much. Then suddenly, Halima and her brother and her husband saw their son, Muhammad's foster brother, who came running back and shouted, Two men dressed in white grabbed my brother and cut his chest. So then Halima and Harith ran to Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him and found him pale faced. When they asked him what happened, he said, Two men came and opened my chest and took a portion of it. After this event, she gave up frosting him and informed his mother about what had happened.
my legs are already started to hurt and I, I mean me. Dear friends, this is the graveyard and that's the bell.
Shakti Sadar, the splitting open of the heart, Ans relates that the angel Jibreel came to the Prophet peace be upon him when he was playing with the boys and took hold of him and laid him on the ground and split open his heart and brought out little bag of blood. Then he said to Muhammad peace be upon him, this is the devil's part of you. After this, Jibril washed the Prophet's heart with Zamzam water and sealed it up to replace it. Then the boys who were with Prophet came running to Halima Sadia, saying, Really, Muhammad is killed! Ans, who say, also says that he has seen the marks of swing in the Prophet's breast. Dear friends, this is the mountain that we climbed and can you see that yellow stone 
that's the point. People who come to perform Hajj and Umrah from especially South Asia countries are often found looking for Bibi Halima's house locations in Taif. Many believe that the village is called Bani Saad in the name of Halima Saadia. Dear friends, we were visiting this place for the first time and I also hope so you got some information. So see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.